Hi. Today, let's see how we can send HTML emails from Apex using the templates that we have uh, in the Salesforce org. Okay, so here is the code. Um, that I have here. I have a template uh, um, in saved in um, classic email templates in Salesforce org. So um, this is the code uh, that I'm using to fetch that particular template. And uh, these are the few lines of code that we need uh, uh, to send the email. So here, uh, some points to note are, when you are fetching uh, the template from the Salesforce org, uh, you do not need to set the subject and body. So this is the common mistake. Uh, don't set uh, these two uh, subject and uh, HTML body. Just don't include these lines. So here in this code, uh, I have excluded those two lines. And then uh, um, this target object ID is the recipient who will be receiving the email. So, and it has to be, uh, it has to be uh, user, contact, lead, or person object. Otherwise, uh, you will get an invalid type for operation error. So, uh, if you ask for here in this example, I am trying to send an HTML email from a court record. The fields I have included in the template are from the court record. So, uh, I had to query uh, the um, court object and then uh, found that record that I wanted to send. And uh, from that court record, I can get the contact ID because uh, this is actually a person object. So it has to be one of these objects only then it will work. Uh, contact lead or person objects. And, uh, and to include the fields of the court record, you have to set the what ID. So this is the code record I'm getting and then uh, ID of the code records. So these are the two important fields that you have to set. And uh, everything else is otherwise pretty much standard. I'll include this code uh, in the description below so you can uh, copy and paste and do the necessary modifications. And here there is also a link to the Salesforce documentation. So just make sure uh, you have in your template in the Salesforce org uh, the merge fields. Um, and you could even try sending a test email uh, from the uh, org itself to make sure you're getting an HTML output. So just make sure not to include uh, these two um, subject and HTML body because it, when we exclude it, um, the code, the Salesforce uh, template will be fetched and uh, the subject and body from the template will be used. Um, that's about it. Thank you.